What is up fellas, this is the Game Hunter with another episode of Monster Tiles TV. In this one, we're gonna go and play in hard difficulty to try to unlock Extreme. I already did that, and it's not that easy. There is a couple of things that you need to take in consideration. For example, to unlock Extreme, you need to finish Hard Wave number 50. And in the previous video that you could probably gonna start seeing on the top of the screen, we were able to reach wave number 35. Why wave number 35 is so important? Because that can unlock the epic towers. And epic towers are so cool. There is really amazing combos that you can create. For example, the soul mage with the ice mage. We have the fire mage with the trend and also fire dragon with commando bot. So if you're not able to finish wave number 50 in hard for the first time, don't worry about it. Try to unlock the epic ones. They're gonna help you to make this run a lot more smooth. All right, here we go. Let's scan them up real quick. I bought a perk that allowed me to have the treasures closer to my base, which is quite handy. Gold, damage. Oh, these are kind of far away. All right, so let's try to aim for gold first, if it's possible. It's not gonna be that easy. Let's go this way. And for the towers, let's start with the Sunflower Pixie so we can get the extra bonification thanks to the Gold Loss. Tag an enemy and drop 300% in this case because my skill points are plus two in gold when the enemy is skilled. Super useful. You try to grow fast in the game. All right, so we're going to get two of those. Start. And for the power-ups, I have the Rag of Riches and also the Power Source. Very good for economy purposes. I think this one... It would be interesting to go to the right side. I prefer to go in the same line or parallel to my base, but because we're trying to reach those two gold treasures, let's go this way. All right, we're going to save some resources in this one. Let's just go and use the power source. Power source, let's see. One, two, three. Excellent. That allowed me to get banking level one, even level two if I want. I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to stay like this. And we can probably get also this little Wolfie. Wolfie is so cool. And in my case, my Wolfie is currently level or rank four. Oh, it's actually level five. And remember, every time that you rank up your tower, you're going to increase the damage of that tower. And you're going to be able to also add more items. That's why it's so useful. The Wolfie is so strong for me in particular. That's why I decided to use it with the Sunflower Pixie. So... We're going to keep that combo. I think we're going to go this way. Try to create a maze. And then Rag of Riches. Rag 2 Riches. I always say <laughs> Rag of Riches. Okay, we can unlock the first level of production. We need energy. Super important. Uh, okay, that is actually taking me in another direction. That's not where I want to go. We're going to upgrade our Wolfie. That's the one performing the damage. Excellent. We can actually call one of the merchants for extra gold. Excellent. Remember, at the beginning, you have to focus in upgrade your banking and production as fast as you can. All right. We are going in that wrong direction. This is not what I was planning to do. So let's see how far we can go. I'm going to upgrade the sunflower for a little bit because I don't have any energy. Give me a curve. Give me a curve. Excellent. Let's go this way. And um, for the next tower, I think I'm going for the Ice Mage. The Ice Mage is going to give the synergy bonus for both towers, the Sunflower and also the Wolfie. So let's see. Do we have enough? No, we need more energy for no wrong. Yeah, we need four. So let's just go. Don't be afraid of using <laughs> the landmines. You get it overwhelmed. Remember that it's going to get recharge very fast let's go back perfect i like it now can we get the excellent now we got the ice golem so we got the bonifications of synergy with the sunflower and also the wolfing this one increased the critical hit chance sunflower increased the skill point which is great now instead of 300 it's going to give me 450 percent goal with an enemy skill all right let's continue going we're going to speed up things a little bit so I can show you what can we do, what kind of changes and what kind of combinations we need to start building in order to be successful in hard difficulty. All right, this is not looking too bad. 
we're gonna save some energy for now let's not get too crazy I think we should be okay with this one level for the wolfie ninjas are kind of annoying but uh having the wolfie at the end is so useful because the special attack is the energy wave it's a powerful wave that does a lot of damage to all the enemies in the same line so it's very good to put this guy at the end of the path so we can hit all the enemies in one go okay so now we are getting closer to the gold bonification and we have production level two super important now we start calling merchants and other pirates to boost our economy see the key is economy first and then you can worry about the rest okay all the enemies are going down those tanks is not an issue perfect now we have more energy for this one uh we can probably go this way get a little bit little bit extra gold i'm not gonna upgrade banking for now what we can do is to try to save and get the combo with the ice mage which is right here the soul mage soul mage is gonna confuse the enemy okay all the nearby enemies causing them to run backwards so the combo is that the soul mage is gonna confuse the enemy they're gonna go back the ice mage is gonna freeze them so it's gonna give me some extra time for me to use wolfie and some other towers to do all the damage so what we're gonna do we're gonna add another 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 wolfie right there still got the bonification excellent that's good i'm gonna save this one for the soul mage and in here we're gonna add this naga why are we added the naga because the uh, naga is gonna also increase the attack speed of the wolfies this one is not getting the bonification but that's okay we can always add another one over there if it's necessary but for now we're good to go okay record reaches probably record reaches Rack to reaches <laughs> it's gonna be coming very soon i'm gonna wait for the oh this is pretty good all right so let's add the soul mage we got the bonification of the ice mage and the ice mage also receive a critical damage bonification wolf is going up you can probably do the bonification and the boost in gold we got the merchants excellent all right so what are we doing in here now we have another opening i'm gonna go that way i'm gonna keep this path straight for the goal if it's a cross, even better, because I would love to have the enemies coming from here. That would be ideal. Okay, so things are looking much better. We can continue upgrading our Wolfie, our Naga. Naga, you need a Scorpion King and Trent. And that shouldn't be a big issue. These kind of waves are perfect for the power source. There is so many different, so many kills that it's very 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 useful all right let's go this way do we have enough for something no but we can upgrade that's the reason that we have this boost in economy okay from here we can add a, a trend maybe in this location let's add the trend over there and you need also the scorpion king right phantom over there perfect we got the scorpion king over there it's gonna cover everybody yes now what naga is more powerful so another one that is worse i mean it's worth it to get upgraded perfect wolf is killing everything from here what is going to be our next target i mean we just need to focus and build a, a strong base and if we can add a treasure that's fantastic but let's not get crazy with that okay from here yeah look can, we can probably close this entrance I have enemies coming from there let's go with the merchant i'm not using the power source yet there's not that many small enemies that i can take advantage okay looking okay you need the fire mage for the critical oh i thought the scorpion king was actually reaching this one seriously how about you Oh, you can get it, but this one doesn't. Oh, no, it's not in range. It's not in range, my friends. It's not in range. I'm going to add another one. Let's give the boost to this trend over here. 
uh, let's go in that direction. Here we go. Let's go to the power source. So we can get a couple of extra energies. Not too bad, we got two or three. Power source is more effective in the late game. Okay, so we have another opening in the bottom of the map. Maybe it's a good idea to add some stings. Add the extra bonification and damage, which is quite good. And also the Scorpion King is going to get all the boost that is needing. So let's upgrade the sting. And with this, should, we should be okay for these entrances. We can cover pretty much everywhere. Naga going up. I need to use the line mines yet. So far, so good. Let's keep moving forward. Okay, we are in reach to one of the bonifications in damage. 13 damage, not too bad. Let me give you a quick update. We have over here the fire dragon, and I decide to also add this beautiful training dummy. Training dummy increase the damage of all the towers in range, which is really good because it's always active. And over here we add the wind mage speed aura. Increase the attack speed for all the towers in range. See, so we're getting the dragon and command the bot with all the bonification that we need to do a lot of damage. Put an extra wolfie over there. We can probably unlock this fella. Uh, what else do we do? We got this other entrance. Nexus bot. To boost also these little stings. We need a phantom. But right now, I haven't opened another entrance in here. So I'm, that's why I'm not so worried. I'm just going to care of the main event right there. This is the part that's going to be very tough so we're gonna continue upgrading the commando bot and also the fire dragon uh, let's go for another wave so i can show you exactly what we're trying to accomplish with this ice mage and also this soul mage right uh well there's no enemies coming any any closer <laughs> so that's good i guess all right where is the next target anything over here no over there yes maybe it's a good idea to add Another I'm gonna go this way. I would love to go up if it's possible. Over there. Perfect. Gonna go Wolfie. Here we go. Let's see if I can show you the the combo that I'm talking about. Maybe I already posted a video about the Ice Mage Soul Mage combo. But if not, well <laughs> check it out. Check this one out. Uh Again, the idea is to have the soul mage confusing the enemies so they come back. This one can freeze them probably both times. First time when they come over here, they can get freeze, they get confused. Then over here we got the fire mage who's gonna do also the extra damage of burning the enemies. Okay, so that's that's what we're trying to accomplish right now. Wave number 40, uh, things are getting a little bit crazy. So we're gonna add over here one of our fellas confusing mage maybe maybe not training dummy is already in range for the dragon should put that one over here but anyway actually i should change it i put the training training dummy here and over here we can add one of the ice mage so we can also freeze enemies in this area get super super handy if it's necessary we can also confuse enemies in this area and we can make enemies slower with the right there with the tots tool all right looking okay uh, we got the bonification not yet now we got it 18 perfect our uh, wolfie is already level 20 we're gonna continue upgrading that one the ball our combo bot and charizard is almost here one more level for the for the dragon so far this this area is taking control of the game see upgraded evolve and little Charizard is in the house. It's way number 45. Very close to reach the the level that we're aiming right now. Let's make a couple upgrades. 
can get also another merchant. Is a merchant. Go, 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 go. Like it. All right. Looking good. All right. Wave number 50. And this is all we need to unlock extreme. So far, we're looking just fine. We're going to add this one here. Perfect. Uh, how about Pixie? I'm just wondering where can we start building another cluster? Let's get this one. Let's get also the Explorer so we can get a verification. Maybe more gold. So far, so good. Here comes the boss. See, confused, heading back, getting freeze. <laughs> I love that combo. <laughs> I love a 15 skill point, skill cooldown. That's great. So we just finished wave 50 in hard. So extreme mode is unlocked. Let's continue going in this run and see how far we can go. I think we're doing just fine. Let's see if we can continue upgrading our towers. Control this enemy. This enemy is a problem, but yeah, we were able to stop them. We have landmines if it's necessary. See, everybody's getting stuck. Everybody's getting stuck. Confused shield, confused shield, confused shield. Right. Landmine, just in case. I don't want to lose that many lives. How many we lost? Ooh, that was a lot, man. <laughs> that was a lot. I wasn't expecting to lose that many lives. Okay, two for two, perfect. To keep upgrading these fellas. We can get this one, we can get also bonification from the Explorer. Here we go. Okay, power source. Can we get the bonification in damage? Come on, 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 come on. No, there are too many. There are too many. Come on, let me, let me finish wave 60. That will make me a lot happier than 59. There you go. 61. Still alive. Somehow. All right, we can add another curve over there. Uh, this is the area that needs a lot more damage. I'm, I haven't upgraded my Naga that much, my Wolfie either. That is not good. Oh, three lives to go. Ah, oh, that's terrible. Made a mistake. Made a mistake. Come on, come on, give me a goal. Give me a goal. Go, 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 go. Reaches, reaches, reaches. No, oh, new record. Wave 60. We got tons of credit and player XP. That's great. And with that, you unlock extreme. See, so that's why it's important to don't get too crazy. Just finish hard until wave 35 and then with the epic towers it's gonna be a lot more easy for you to reach your goal and unlock extreme and extreme is very good especially when we have those events that give you extra bonifications in credits or player xp because remember in extreme you get nine times credit rewards and four times player xp that's just fantastic remember Killing XP is so important so your towers can rank up, do more damage, and they can use more items too. Fellas, this is the Game Hunter signing off. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.